So do you have any New Year's resolutions this year? Uh... Okay guys, she's asking another question that we don't have the answer to. Um, any ideas? And make it quick. <laughs> That's what she said. Comedy, you have 10 years of improv experience. Can you use it? Fine. Fine, just say sleep with Kelly Clarkson. <sighs> she's getting a divorce. Sam. It could happen. Seriously, what are your New Year's resolutions? <laughs> Why do you let her take control like that? Seriously, seriously, I, uh... Okay, anybody else have any ideas? Numbers? Well, statistically, we never accomplish our resolutions, so there's really no use in trying anymore. That's not true. We've accomplished some. The last one we accomplished was in 2012. Really? What was it? To be completely out of the closet. Yeah, I couldn't hold that one in any longer. Yeah, she even came to me for help. I wasn't comfortable saying it out loud. Yeah, so I wrote a song about how gay I was and then sang it in front of 40 strangers. It was, it was the, the coolest thing, thing I've, I've ever done. done. Ah, uh, yes, 2012. That was the year of the Kelly Clarkson Greatest Hits Chapter 1 album and the songs Catch My Breath and People Like Us. Thank you for the tidbit, useless knowledge. We still need a New Year's resolution, guys. Headline the Orlando Improv. COVID. Move back to New York City and perform at Caroline. COVID. This year has broken me. <laughs> Stop using our secrets as punchlines, you animal. But they work out so well. Like, we got a standing ovation when we came out, and I'm just trying to chase that high. You got any more? I'm not giving you anything. Hey, okay, you two. Useless knowledge, anything. We could make our resolution to write 10 minutes a day. Like we set a timer, we sit down, and we write for 10 minutes. And it doesn't matter if it's good or anybody's gonna see it, it just helps us practice. It's a little change we can make that can make a big difference. Whoa. Where'd you get that from? I went down a YouTube wormhole, search videos on productivity. Instead of just being productive? Yeah. Well, that sounds awful. 10 minutes is too long. I'm not doing that. Really? Because every time somebody gave you 10 minutes on stage, you usually went 12, 13. Well, you see, we can talk forever. But the idea of sitting in a room alone for 10 minutes in complete silence while we write something that probably isn't going to be funny and nobody's going to hear anyway, or maybe we even just don't write anything at all, petrifies us. So we might as well not even try. I thought we weren't revealing our secrets. Okay, okay, that's enough. Secrets. I'm sure you have a New Year's resolution that you'd like to tell Rachel. So just go on. Me? Talk to Rachel directly? Mm-hmm. You need my help? No. Okay. <clears throat> so my New Year's resolution is, I don't know, just to keep doing what we're doing. Like, 2020 threw us a lot of curveballs, and I don't know, we managed just to land on our feet. And, and so I think 2021 should be better, but even if it's not, I just... My New Year's resolution is to keep leaning on you and be strong enough for you to lean on me. Chunky, chunky. Come here, baby. Come my baby. <laughs> <laughs> it's so hurtful because she didn't listen, but it's also super funny. <laughs> Are we supposed to be social distancing? Can you put her six feet away from me, please? <laughs> You had one shot, and what you said was, like, so beautiful, and she didn't even hear it. <laughs> we don't have six feet of space. We're inside her brain. And Sam's head is smaller than the average human head, so that gives us even more limited space. So I'm sorry, Secrets, but when it comes to comedy, you can't break away. <gasps> no, please. Please do. I'll spread my wings and I'll learn how to fly. I'll do what it takes till I touch the sky. Now, make a wish, make a change, make a change, and pray.